Yourself. Back from state? Yeah. Um, no, I don't think I have my. You had the girls. Yeah, I saw that. I, yeah. I saw both the girls in the picture. Yeah, that was awesome. The whole family there. That's good. They're, Do you think they're stopping, or are they just gonna like? Stop? I I was told they were stopping. Oh, they're stopping. Okay. So, so we're just waiting for the bus like to get to here. The school or, okay. I was told they were stopping. Yeah. Okay. That don't you remember football? You were here. Yeah. They yeah. stopped and they all got out. That's true. Wrestling, they you know it was just different. It's just different because they don't come back to the next day. Yeah. Man, the bus broke camp. He just said. He just said we're time. We're waiting on the bus to get in here. Well, uh, the, I just got confirmation from the bus driver's wife that they're at Spring Creek. Hopefully, I'm going to get a word with uh, all three of the state champions and Clo. I'm going to try to find uh, Goodman when he gets here and talk to him, too. State champs coming into town on a brisk Sunday. What's up, Dana? Right now, we're just waiting for... The bus to get here. I'm going to try to catch a word with Josh Collins, Kai Carson, Braden Carson, and then Coach Claw. Three state champs and the coach. It's kind of cold out here. I'm just waiting on the bus to get here right now. They're at Spring Creek. Appreciate everybody for tuning in. This is a big deal. Uh, they don't really have, I mean, they don't come back until the day after for wrestling. So they don't get to do like what we did for uh, for football and, you know, have the party down at the pizza place and everybody greet them. So this is what it is right here. There's some people turning up. There's a few people down here. It's freezing. The Bicinius's are here, of course. It's, it, 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 it's not warm. So, yeah, the, the bus was at Spring Creek about four minutes ago. So I want to try to s grab uh, Braden Carson, Kai Carson, Josh Collins, and then Coach Clell. Maybe Goodman if he gets down here. All right, there's a couple of the coaches here. Let's go talk to them. Let's go talk to these guys real fast. We're interrupting us. What's up, fellas? How's it going? You're in front of a lot of people. Say hello. What's up? How's the trip? It was good. It was fun. Yeah. yeah. It's a lot of fun. Good wrestling. Yep. Yeah. Team wrestled well. Beat it hard. Got it we got two Two of the state champs are returning. Uh, yeah. yep. Collins is a junior, right? Yep. Yep. So we, we'll have Kai and Collins back next year. Yeah, Kai's a sophomore? Yeah, bro. Team's uh, young, really, really young. Only three huh? seniors, so got a lot coming back. It'll be fun next year too. What, they won't let you guys ride the bus. No, we don't want to ride the bus. That probably either. stinks in there, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, whoa! <laughs> I used to coach eighth grade football, dude. These kids don't shower <laughs> nowadays, and we would be like down this in Southern Oregon, four-hour <laughs> ride, man. Well, yeah, wrestling you have to shower. I mean, you got to wash that funk off you. Who's your uh, wrestler of the tournament? Put you on the spot. Let's go. Uh, Talk. Braden Carson. Yeah, Braden Carson. It has to be, right? Yeah, this is three time, yeah. The Grand's first. The very first ever. Yeah, pretty cool. His brother's going to try and match him. So. Yeah, that's going to be cool. I'm excited for that. Very cool. I mean, I think we had some guys in the past that could do it. Circumstances just weren't right, but it's so awesome that Braden, man, three time state champion. That takes a lot of uh. Josh is going to be the four-time finalist. Oh yeah, huh? He got Josh's second, second, fir first. Yeah. Was he wrestling that Mor Moro kid? His freshman year. That kid's tough, dude. <laughs> that kid is yeah. tough. Yeah. Just waiting for the bus. It's warm out here in my mind. 
good, baby. Did you guys just come back today? Yeah? That was the drive, okay? No weather. Yeah. Waiting on the bus. Yeah. He should have got in. He should have got in. It would have been awesome. Jim out there. Did you guys get to catch any of the uh, 5A matches? No. It was a whole different... Oh, it was in a different town this year. I forgot about that. Yeah, it was. Completely forgot. Completely. I, I, the last one I was at was 2019. And everybody was in this, you know, it was 5A, 4A. Your son, he's 5A? Or My you? son's 5A, yeah. He, 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 dude, he busted his bursa sack and... His knee, he, he qualified, couldn't rest. I mean, his knee, I'll yeah, show you yeah. a pic, he, yeah. dude. It's <laughs> it's bad. He, he, I mean, he's young, he's only a sophomore. So, and and the kid in 5A at 220 is a, the kid from uh, I think it's uh, Crook County. Is I think, yeah, it, dude, 220 is a really tough weight for a 15 year old to wrestle at. But he had a good year. I mean, I'm, I'm impressed. He, this is only his third year wrestling, and he he was a basketball player. And the football coach said, "In Dallas, football players wrestle." And I mean, Dallas is a wrestling school, so he was like, "All right, I'm gonna start wrestling." He did well. I didn't even bring up him coming here. <laughs> it's been talked about, not nah. <laughs> nah, he grew. That, that would just be bad. But he 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 loves the OU, dude. He already lo I mean, obviously, as a dad, a six foot five left-handed pitcher that's fifteen is already throwing eighty low eighties. I would want more than Eastern for him, and, and that's not being like. Uh, I don't think that's being like over. You know what I mean? Like, I I would want him to. I want him to play baseball, really. Well, you're too good to ride the bus? I go watch my sister play volleyball. He got fifth place. Yeah. Jared Armstrong. Say hello to the people. Hello. Oh, you went You Where was your sister playing volleyball at? Um, volleyball. Oh, nice. I saw your whole your whole family was there, dude. And then Maya Lise was posting that they, they were watching yeah, in a gym it. somewhere. <laughs> That's awesome. So cool. <laughs> Still waiting for the bus. This bus, the bus that was supposed to get here at five thirty. <laughs> Did you guys come home last night or today? Dude, that twenty nineteen when Johnny and I went and covered the whole thing, we had the sweetest Airbnb, dude. It was just cush. And we ordered, so we, we we didn't we didn't know everything shuts down around there because we stayed right there in the Hawthorne. Everything shuts down, even Denny's at like twelve o'clock, right? So we ordered the uh, DoorDash, and it was this uh, place called the Lunchbox. It was a food truck. Some of the best food I ever had. Oh, was the bus coming? So we need to get the fee taken care of? Yes. Yeah. Good order, There's no bus coming yet, just relax. Should be here anytime. Huh? They just took the exit. That's the bus driver's wife. I don't know her name, but she's awfully sweet.
This is about as busy as downtown LeGrand's been on a Sunday in like 20 years. Twenty twenty two state champion wrestling team coming in. Try to get a word with all three of the state champs and with Clell. We'll see. They're they've had a long day. They had the bus broke down in Portland. That's why the bus is late. It was supposed to be home at about five thirty today. I got some insider information from the bus driver's wife. If you can't be in person, at least you can be here with me. I'll uh I'll take the cold for you guys. This is a really young wrestling team. Only three seniors on the whole team. Um, two of the three state champs are Collins is a junior, Kai's a sophomore. So I mean, there's good things coming for this wrestling team too. Man, I think the bus driver's slow rolling it. Maybe he's coming in the back way. Well, I mean, it would be smart to come in this way and park, right? That's what they did last time. They're not parking? I think they're parking. I think they're going by slow. Okay, then I'm not going to get a word with anybody because they're not parking. But at least you get to see them. They're going to go real slow. Hopefully. I'm going to get out in the street so you guys can see them. Maybe we could have got some cops down here to stop some traffic. Oh, there is a cop. There is. Okay, there they are. I just saw, yeah, see, there's cop lights down there. Here they come. I thought they were going to stop, but apparently they're not going to stop, so I'm not going to get to talk with anybody, but at least you guys will get to see them come in. 2022 state champions, 4A wrestling, the Grand Tigers. Here they come. I'm gonna try to get out there like close. <laughs> Bus is in the middle there. There's people honking. Those people had the right idea. Thirty-two people watching live. Let's slow down. We gotta slow down. There it is right there. They even put the lights on. Set off somebody's car alarm. That wasn't real slow. That was super fast. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> hey, that was it. that's it, folks. They're not going to stop, so it's cold. The bus is late, so let these guys get home. They got school tomorrow. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in.